by BBY. Uh, yeah. Can we tell the difference between Libby's canned 100% pure pumpkin and Walmart Great Value canned 100% pure pumpkin? He's ready for it. I'm ready for it. And we hope you are ready for it because welcome to the Miko Mouse Show. Jazz hands. And welcome to the second episode of our Halloween holiday pumpkin can pumpkin trilogy thing. Ah, that was a lot. That was, we got through it, but barely. Let's do the thing. Let's do the thing. Once again, take a little bit. You can take a lot of it. These ones look very similar. I'll spread that out a little bit for you. Um, we did get a request from the network. Could you not eat it all in five seconds? Um, because remember, you have very expensive taste that you can't maintain without this job. Um, so, you know, if you eat it all in five seconds, the network won't be happy. And based on your past experience, you're on thin ice, I think. That one belongs on this one, that one, wait, I, and visually speaking, uh, ew, that one just got flung over from your mouth. I'm not gonna eat that tiny bit, because that's gross. Anyways, visually speaking, these ones are almost identical. If you watched our last episode, you'll know that the two were kind of different, and I could kind of tell them apart. These ones, I can't really tell apart. Color-wise, they pretty much look the same. Uh, liquid, like consistency, they're both about the same as well. This one, which came off of this plate, may be a little bit more watery, but other than that, I can't tell them apart. They look the same. And also, okay, so you do like that one. So once again, keep that in your, your brain. I know you really like it, but keep it in your brain and think about it because, okay, well, you know, I have to do my tasting and you have time to think about it. It's what the network wants, okay? Even though it's your show, I don't have, a, I'm not getting involved in this fight. I, I do not, I'm just the intern. I get paid no money to do this. I'm gonna taste the one that came off this plate first. Mm. The flavor of that one, very strong. Very not unbalanced, but uh, you, you don't have to lick it on my mouth. You are gonna get the plate here like in a second. I'm tasting the one that came off this plate now. Huge difference, massive difference between the two. I'll let him clean up and I will explain what I'm thinking. So kind of like our last video, if you've watched that one, where one of them was super earthy flavored and like very strong flavored and the other one was kind of lighter, crisper, kind of the same thing here. The one that came off the plate he just licked, which is the one that belongs on your left, Goodness, we got plates banging into everything. You really don't know which one you like better yet, do you? This one, way deeper flavor. I actually agree with you 100% this time. I do think this one is better. The reason is this one is much more balanced and a little bit more sweeter than this one. This one's very earthy, more earthy than the last ones that we tried. I'm assuming that because I didn't taste anything this earthy last round, that that means that this one is probably Walmart Great Value. And that one may be Liddy's, which would be in line with what he normally does, which is picking the name brand expensive stuff. I meant Libby's. I don't know why I keep saying Liddy's. I don't know what Liddy's is, but this one is Libby's with a B, L-I-B-B-Y. Uh, yeah, you, he's calming it down. He's saying, let's flip the things because he needs to know which one to add to his shopping list for this weekend. I think that this one is A, which is the name brand Libby. And I think that this one is B, which is the generic brand Walmart Great Value because it was so earthy. Let's flip it. Or do you want to do it this time? It's really fun. You get to go, Boosh! and this one is B. This one is the generic brand, Walmart Great Value, and that makes this one A, which is, yeah, were you changing your mind? I'm surprised. Uh, I'm surprised that, you know, this one was as earthy as it tasted. I'm surprised that he picked the cheap one for once, which is nice, but, you know, there's always room for him to change his mind in the future, now that he knows the price on everything. Yeah, see, there we go, he, he's changed his mind. Did you, okay, I'll flip this one too. Yeah, so, yeah, see, that's, that one's A. Yeah, that, that, this one is the name brand Libby. We didn't pull a fast one on you. 
and put two Bs out there. Now that we've tasted all three, it'll be super interesting to see which one he picks in the next episode, which is between Walmart Great Value and Food Lion. He's saying that he's gonna pick neither, but you can't do that. That's against the rules. Once again, whole network thing. With that said, let's do the outro, unless you learned something. What did you learn? He learned that, um, I don't know what he learned. Let's do the outro. Ooh, we'll see you in the next one. Ooh, we'll see you in the next one. Ooh, we'll see you in the next one.